Um, the accent's all. I'm Melvin and I'm from the Philippines and it's my invention. And the title of my project that's related to this one is characterization and the visibility of an LPG sensing device with discrete output indicators for household and taxi LPG needs. First, in the Philippines, we have a common problem in calamities and disasters. And most especially, it's related to fire incidents and explosion incidents. Now, why did this happen? Because people are not warned that there are locations, there are fuel tanks or gas tanks. So I made a solution to one of these problems by making an LPG sensing device. I call it an LPG sensing device because in Philippines households and taxi cabs, we commonly use liquefied petroleum gas. But the good thing about this one, it can, it can also detect and detect and detect some natural gases, and also it can detect the natural gas that you use in your barbecue tanks here in the USA. I've heard that you Americans love barbecue outdoors, so I made one in a cabin. You can also use this in your cars for your fuel tanks. Now, first, this is the microphone. This is not technically a microphone that catches sound. It's an MQ5 microphone that detects the fumes of different natural gases. Once it collects the data or gathers the fumes, the data is entered through this microcontroller, especially programmed for this one to give the output or the level or amount of leakage that is already present around the LPG tank or the gas tank. As you can see, it's all interconnected to one another. Um, this is the main processor, and this is the, the port A, this is the output port, this is port B. And as you can see, when it enters the port A, it, it is processed in this processor. It comes out to these eight, eight ports that gives the output, which is connected to eight LED light bulbs. Each LED light bulb corresponds to the level of leakage. Now, why do I make eight LED light bulbs? To give people a warning and they will do the right response or right action in case of this incident. First, it takes so the level one leakage, or the level one, which is just a minor leakage, what will, what will people think? Of course, they will, do, they will not panic because they know they can do more, they can do something to prevent an accident. But if they see the level 8 leakage, which is already in this red one, they will tend to do actions faster and they will respond to it immediately. That's why I made these 8 types of 8 levels of leakages. It is convenient to use this one because it's just small, it's compact, and it will just cost it cheap. Because in the Philippines, the Philippines it's around 3,000 pesos, but in the US, I think it's around just 50 to 60 dollars. And, and it comes with the. And as you can see, this is developed by the University of the Philippines, the microphone. Mm -hmm. I computer program it to make it work. Um, this MQ5 microphone just costs around. One 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 dollar and fifty cents. So it's really convenient to use this one. Actually, I've already tested this one through the help of the Department of Energy in the Philippines. I'm trying to do this their laboratory. I can't do it at home. Um, as you can see in the left picture right there, that's a level four leakage, and the right one is a level eight leakage, where the red light is already turned on. I I made this one to help people to be warned or to be safe in case of this. Incidents, and I, I, wa I want to lessen the incidents also of explosions and fire. I'm, so maybe someday there could be a problem right far up in forest if there is an LPG tank or a gas tank at the slip. So it is really convenient to use with this one. You can bring it outdoors, indoors, and you can place it anywhere. Yeah. Um, and that's 